Taunton, Massachusetts, a young woman charged with using text messages to encourage her boyfriend to kill himself when they were teenagers sent a text to a friend from high school about two months after the death, saying, and quote it and a pose s my fault and quote, according to testimony at her trial on Wednesday. Michelle Carter, then 17, cajoled Conrad Roy 318 to kill himself in July 2014 with a series of texts and phone calls prosecutors allege. Roy died when his pickup truck filled with carbon monoxide in a store parking lot in Fairhaven. And quote it and a pose s my fault and quote, Carter texted to her school friend Samantha Boardman. And quote I could have stopped him, but I told him to get back in the car. Boardman was among several of CARTER and a pose s friends and acquaintances who took the witness stand on the second day of the involuntary manslaughter trial in Taunton Juvenile Court. Those who testified on Wednesday described CARTER and a pose s texts to them in the hours before and after Roy took his life some saying he was missing, some saying she was on the phone with him when he died and some said they were surprised at the texts because they WERN and a pose t very close with Carter reports CBS Boston. And quote I was talking on the phone with him when he killed himself, I heard him die and quote, Carter texted to Olivia Mazolgo days after ROY and a pose s death, Mazolgo testified. Mazolgo also said Carter told her she felt like she had no friends and was never invited to parties, reports CBS Boston. Mazolgo said that even though they were not close, she went to CARTER and a pose s house to comfort her after ROY and a pose s suicide. Another acquaintance, Alexandra Ithier, testified she had known Carter for only a few days when Carter told her about ROY and a pose s death. In opening statements Tuesday, the prosecution described Carter as a high schooler without many friends who wanted the sympathy and attention of being a grieving girlfriend. CARTER and a pose s lawyer, however, disputes a crime occurred. Attorney Joseph Cataldo said Roy was depressed, had attempted suicide before, researched suicide methods online, and was completely responsible for his own death. He said CARTER and a pose s text messages are protected free speech. Carter, now 20, also told Boardman that she feared getting in trouble after she found out that police had ROY and a pose s phone. And quad I and a pose m done and quad, Carter wrote in one text displayed in the courtroom. And quad his family will hate me, and I can go to jail. And quad, two other friends say Carter texted them saying she was on the phone with Roy as he died. Carter expressed remorse in a message to a friend, and quad I and a pose m the only one he told things to. I should have gotten him more help, and quad, she wrote. The police detective who conducted the criminal investigation also testified. Fairhaven detective Scott Gordon said he found ROY and a pose s phone and discovered the text conversation between Roy and Carter. The case is being tried without a jury, and a judge will deliver the verdict. The judge visited the site where ROY and a pose s truck was found on Wednesday afternoon.